Welcome everybody, uh, thank you for watching this video. My name is Nina, I am a student of the specialization Health and Society, which falls under the Master Communication, Health and Life Sciences, um, and there's also the other specialization, Communication Innovation. There's also a video about that if you would like to watch it, where another student tells about her experiences. Um, but I'm here to talk about the specialization Health and Society. One more little thing, you might wonder why, where I am. Well, I'm in my room videoing this um, because I also have to adhere to the rules and the regulations that are there due to the coronavirus. Um, so yeah, just so you know. Um, well, uh, like I said, I'm doing the specialization Health and Society. I'm actually almost at the end. I hope to graduate in like one or two months. So well, I can really look back uh, at what I've been doing and experienced during this master. I would like to talk about some general things of why I chose uh, Wageningen and this master, and then I will highlight three things that I really enjoyed during this master. Um, so first of all, generally Wageningen, it's a really cute small city. Um, it has quite an international sphere, um, so you get to meet lots of other people from other places. Um, and the program, um, the courses in the program, they're not with hundreds of people, which translates into teachers uh, knowing your name, wanting to help you. You know, they're, they want to get involved with you and help you throughout the program. So I think that's very valuable. And then lastly, one of the main reasons why I chose this program is due to the freedom that you get. So the Health and Society has quite a broad focus. You know, health can be defined more um, relating to social health or physical health or things to do with uh, food. Um, so uh, you get to fill out the program in a sense that fits your interest. Of course, there are also some mandatory courses. Um, but yeah, I was really happy I got to do things my way. Um, and that resulted in me really enjoying this program. So the first course that I would like to highlight, um, actually, this is a course that well, all other master students at the university can choose, and a lot of them do. Um, it's called the Academic Consultancy Training, and you basically come together in a multidisciplinary group with students from other programs. So we had a biology student, international development student, and we worked on a, a project that was given by an outside commissioner. So it was a real life project, um, and you work together. There's some time pressure as well, but you learn a lot because it's uh, intense group work. Um, and that's probably very valuable for, you know, work later on where you'll also be working on projects, maybe. Um, so that was really fun and especially because it's a real life thing. So you get to experience some, you know, more practical um, things as well. Then secondly, my internship, which I finis finished last year. I did it at the European Public Health Association. Um, it's an NGO and I worked uh, on an assignment concerning the European Union. I um, also got to present my work at the European Public Health Conference in Marseille, which was really exciting, also a little bit scary, but um, I was really happy I got the opportunity to do this, that this rolled out of my internship. Um, so yeah, highlight as well, for sure. And then lastly, right now I'm working on my master thesis. And again, here there's freedom, you know, you can either um, make up um, a thesis a subject of, uh, that, that you would like or you go along with a project that's already existing. So I chose to do mine from scratch, my own idea. I'm writing it about the well-being of women in disaster with the gender equality aspect in there as well. Um, I actually went abroad for, my, uh, for gathering the data. I went to St. Martha in the Caribbean where I had loads of interviews with people um, and women, of course. And uh, right now I'm finishing it off. I'm busy with the analysis and um, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's, it's a long period. It's at least six months that you're working on it. So um, it's quite a big chunk. So it's nice that you can choose to fill it in how you want to. So um, I would also like to mention that there is a PowerPoint online in which the program is specified in way more depth with way more details about the admission requirements also some courses that are highlighted, the courses that exist that you have to do or can choose. Um, and there's a chat as well, which uh, me and the study advisors are online at, and you can ask your questions, maybe make an appointment for a call um, and 
yeah, so I hope we can help you further there. And I wish you the best of luck with your choice. And hopefully we'll see you back. Bye.